Yo you guys, what is going on? It's Blazendary here. And today in this video, I have for you a really awesome mystery box. This is coming from, as you guys can see, right here from the sticker, Saru General. He's an amazing Instagram seller that I've known for a little while now. I was originally put on by Jacob Starr, and I've seen Harrison do some stuff. I got my own mystery box that I'm going to unveil to you guys. I'm so excited to get into it. It's going to be really cool because I haven't received a mystery box from Saru General, and I know that's one of his specialties that he does a lot on his website. If you guys want to check out his website, it's going to be linked in the description below along with his Instagram where he sells fire every single Sunday. 140 different items go up just about every week. I I've also teamed up with Sara General to give away a $500 mystery box to one of you guys. This mystery box right here, I'm really looking forward to getting into it. And I will say before I keep going, I actually recorded this video once before. And you guys are like, oh, that means you saw the items. No, I only saw two of them. And you guys are going to see why right now. All right, so check this out, guys. The camera is super out of focus. Oh my, oh my God. Sheesh. As I was opening the box, I noticed it wasn't the best camera angle. Oh. And now, as you guys can see, I've decided to come back to this traditional setting and I just slapped a black piece of tape right here on the box. I do have, of course, the original clips of me opening the box for the first time. So I wanted to do this video correct. So I am sitting right here. So I'm gonna go ahead, crack it open once again. I've only seen two items and I will, of course, play the original recording. No freaking way, dude. And this box is also pretty amazing because as you guys can see, it's got bait tape all around it. And I don't want you guys to think bait tape is cheap because it's not. Open it back up. I just forgot about this one, so technically three now. These are the three t-shirts that were on top and I still have yet to see everything else in this mystery box. This first one we have right here is in, as you guys can see, a Saru General bag, which I wanna talk about first. Star General only sells 100% authentic items as well as the condition chart that he offers on his website. This first one is the highly coveted yellow on purple. A lot of people call this the Lakers colorway. Came out a little while ago. I want to say it released back in 06. And the box logo quality, guys, is flawless. Check that thing out. There is no cracking on it whatsoever. I'm definitely looking forward to wearing it as it is a size medium. This is gonna be a ranking my favorite items from like top to bottom. I think this is gonna be, of course, right in the top spot. Oh, I actually forgot to take out an item in this one. The first item to go up in the shelf is that Lakers colored box logo. Then of course, the second box logo that was on the top. Whew. This one, guys, is amazing. This right here is a special one. Supreme did this after the 9-11 attack in New York. This came out in 2002, so just a little bit after what happened on September 11th, 2001. Check out that print, guys. It says Supreme underneath the flag. I'm a huge fan of this box logo. Definitely gonna wear it. I mean, the Travis ones would be an amazing outfit choice. It's almost like a guessing game because once I place the item, I'm not gonna be able to unplace them. So I have to strategically guess what our box value is made up of. And lastly, guys, in this one, as you guys can see, just based on the logo alone, it's not your traditional happy face babe. This guy is looking a little more angrier than usual. And that is because it's a certain year and I don't know if it's a certain collab, Another thing we can also tell is the fact that the size tag is very old as well. I'd probably go ahead and just like pop it right here. I think that's a good spot for it. All right, and I don't even know how many items are left out of this. Oh no, <laughs> I want to keep the box. Gotta keep it crisp. That vape tape makes it worth like five bucks. I'm not even joking. All right guys, we got a ton left. Oh, we got a pair of shoes right here. So I'll take these out too. Ah! I don't want to look at the rest. So right here, we have two more items. Obviously, we can tell this right here is a pair of shoes, so let me get the bubble wrap off. Yo, that's freaking fire. So this right here is a pair of Bapestas, right? Now you might be wondering, well, Blaze, you've talked about Bapestas on your channel before in the past, and for those of you that haven't seen Bapestas, I'll go ahead and fill you in. By the way, that's my chair. The Bapesta is a complete- Okay, maybe not a complete ripoff, but still. Rip off of the Nike Air Force One. SpongeBob collab babe stuff. It's a really old and rare one. Look at the similarity, ready? Pretty much the same shoe. Nonetheless, Bapes does have done a ton of their own stuff. 
over the years with their own collabs. As you guys can see right here, we have the SpongeBob one. I'm definitely gonna clean this pair up. It just needs a little bit of TLC, tender loving care. And uh, I mean, shoot, these are these are staying in the collection. And yes, I know SpongeBob and Bape have collabed in the past because this is my personal SpongeBob and Baby Milo hand towel. I'm gonna guess, I mean, I'm gonna check the year. I'm gonna guess it's like 2006. If you guys wanna go ahead and win your own $500 mystery box, all you guys have to do is do a couple simple steps. First, you have to go ahead, smash a big like on this video. Like, that is so easy. Just make that button blue. Follow Saru General and Giancarlo Perch on Instagram. And then go ahead, drop a comment down below saying that you have followed on Instagram Giancarlo Perch and Saru General. That's it. Drop your own username when you make this comment and use those three steps to enter into a $500 giveaway. Make sure you do those steps. 2008? 2008? Uh, 2007 almost. And then right here, we also have it. Oh, it's kind of peeking through on the front a little bit. Oh no, I have to rank them. Let's see, I placed these Johns. We'll do a little bit of a nice pattern on the Calyx because this is my first time interacting with, with something in the background, y'all. I have a small feeling on what this item is going to be. This right here, guys. Wall clock, and check it out. 1112, is that actually the top? No. But this clock is in pristine condition. There are no scratches, cracks, or anything like that along the front. And I would have to value this thing maybe at around 90 to 100 bucks. And it actually is giving a terrible reflection on the light. All right, guys, let's see. We have a couple more items to go. I know what this is. Uh, I can't actually tell, but it's a Supreme air freshener. I have a Pink Panther one that they did a little bit ago. So this is the Pina Colada Pink Panther air freshener. This is a very graphic air freshener. Well, I'm gonna do my best to not get demonetized. I mean, you guys go ahead, Google it, but like, I can't show this or my demonetization little yellow blip is gonna come up and mm -mm. probably right here nothing visible if these are dice i'm gonna lose my holy you're joking yo this is like my grail this is my grail god i don't want to ruin it opening it i have been hunting blazendary why are you freaking out over some dice right now they're very old accessory oh wow and it's magnetic it's like such a nice display item. The dye themselves are red. They have Supreme on each one. These are in like the magic category for me. It's like, oh, you think of dice, like you could think of cards and dye. And that was one of the things that I used to use a lot in like my magic tricks. Really cool Supreme accessory. Boom. Quite a bit of things to get into. Well, I wanna do two things right here. Boom. Check this item out right here, guys. Supreme, back in like 03 or 04, released Nikes that had the same star pattern on them. And this is also like a UNC color. I'm in North Carolina right now. This is definitely like that Tar Heel blue color. This is a beanie. I'm not gonna put it on because I wanna Lysol it. I don't know if it was brand new or not, but I'm gonna take my own chances. This beanie is mad old. Definitely am not letting this thing leave the collection right there. We're gonna do this one. And we're gonna do... I'm genuinely speechless. Val, I'm genuinely speechless. What? These are supreme playing cards. You guys, this is actually insane. These came out a damn long time ago. I wanna guess maybe 2013, 2012, 2011. So these are a really old item. They're gold. By the looks of them and the condition, they have been used just a little bit. I used to do magic. And I'm gonna, just for fun, link my magic channel in the description. <laughs> I wanna place this item like right next to the freaking dice, yo. Whoa. This is a very old accessory as well. I don't condone it, but this is a cigarette ashtray. It says, see you in hell along the brim, which is, I mean, like another thing, okay. <laughs> 
and it's got Supreme right there on the front. This accessory came out in 2011. It's old, more of them are gonna break, and in 2019, eight years later, this thing sells for around 100 to 200 bucks. I'm gonna place it right here on this lower tier shelf. We're on our last two items. Okay. It looks like the Wilson football. First time now that I'm getting a good view of it. Wow, this football is another rare one. And I know they made colors too, so it looks to be dead stock. And as you guys can see, we have right here the world famous Wilson football. This is an amazing item, and I will say it definitely makes up quite a bit of the price of this box. I'm gonna pop this guy right here. Looks like this is our last item. I know what this is. This right here is a 2019 promotional bait magazine. I actually have one in a table over there, but it's too much to get to. This right here we have is a free promotional waste bag. They've kept up this magazine internally for years. Yeah, we're missing an accessory right there. Almost had it perfectly planned out. Well, technically no. If I move these over, then it's a perfect cubicle. Minus the crowbar, the crowbar is not part of this mystery box. quite a haul and I'm so glad it worked out in this little art deco order. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, like the video, follow Sar General and John Carlo Perch on Instagram and drop a comment down below letting me know you guys have completed those steps and you guys will be entered into a $500 mystery box giveaway. It's Blazonary. I'm out. Stay positive. Peace.